Welcome to Drawing Software. This version comes with a major redesign of the user interface and even the software logic. This recording will be our quick start guide and our intention is to help you become familiar with working with this new version and help you start using the software right away. When the application begins, you always see the Welcome tab. This tab gives you easy access to resources and lets you quickly complete common tasks. For instance, you can easily create a new design using just a blank canvas. Or you can load any existing designs. Likewise, you can import any artwork for a new design. For example, old embroidery designs or artwork files like photos or vector images. The Designs browser can help you navigate and locate designs or various artwork sources. Click on any design to load it or on any artwork file to import it into a new design. As you can see, any design you create or open is loaded onto a new tab. So you can easily navigate through the loaded designs just by clicking on the different tabs while you can always switch back to the Welcome tab. To open any of the recent designs, you can just use this list. Use this slider to change the size of the previous icons or change to Details view. Now, through the Welcome tab, you can also select an embroidery machine and a default hoop. Additionally, you can select a fabric for the design. The fabric selection is crucial because the software automatically optimizes the embroidery according to the fabric type. If you are not particularly familiar with the use of the software, you can refer to the software user guide or view any of the training video tutorials. Now, when a design is loaded, you can see all the designing tools on the tools bar. We, can, we will not go into details about the available tools at this point, so so I'll just show you the basic routines. When you select a certain design part, you can easily perform modifications through the available toolbars. The specific tools, the particular options of those toolbars, dynamically change according to the techniques you enable for each design. The available techniques are cut, embroidery, stencil, crystals, paint. So, according to the enable techniques, the available toolbars options are altered. So, always have in mind that a tool or an option may not be available with some of the enable techniques, while it may be available in other techniques. For example, if you choose the cut technique, the cut outline type appears. If you enable the crystals technique, you get to see the options that have to do with filling your design with crystals. Have in mind though that you can simultaneously enable more than one techniques. The design routine is simple. You can easily import artwork into your design through the import dialog. Select any design part or create a new one using any of the available tools. You can easily transform the selected part using the mouse or using numeric values. You can easily apply any type of fill or outline using the properties bar to decorate the created object and you can easily apply colors. For embroidery, you can even watch a simulation of the production. And when you're satisfied with the design you created, 
you can easily send it to your machine for production. Enjoy creating!